Hi everybody, I'm Ashley with Bachman's Garden Maintenance and I am here today on site with our hardworking garden maintenance crew in the background. We, um, this client was a past client of ours in Minneapolis and has moved out to the suburbs and has invited us to come along with them. And so today we are getting started on a maintenance overhaul in the backyard by the pool. So one of the gardener's tasks today is to tame the ferns here. Um, not sure if you can tell, but there's a pathway going from the side of the house to the back in the pool area. And uh, we want to make sure that you can travel along the path without getting tickled by the ferns. So what we want to do is um, the ferns do take over and we're not sad about having to get rid of a lot of them because um, they'll come back if we let them. So what we'll do is uh, push them back quite a bit, probably about a foot or more on both sides of the pathway. Um, and it'll open up a lot of room to walk. And then what we'll also do is move the ferns back uh, behind the edging a couple of feet. Um, we'll just take them out. Um, that way we have some more room for planting in the front. We can get some color in here um, and neaten it up quite a bit. So the transformation will be huge. Another task for our gardeners today at this site is to do some weeding. There's lots of weeds back here. Um, we have a lot of Virginia stickweed growing back here, which is a very sticky weed. The seeds will stick to your pants, your dog's fur, and it's impossible to get out. Um, so we want to get all of that out of here. Um, and as long as we stay on top of it, it will find somewhere else to grow. Uh, we also want to make sure that the Virginia creeper growing along the fence here is taken care of because as we all know, it will take over and um, strangle everything <laughs> in its path. So we will get rid of that today. Um, another task as you can see, there's a whole bunch of buckthorn growing on the neighbor's property over the fence line um, into our client's property. So what we'll do is uh, take our pruners and um, cut back the buckthorn growing over on this side of the fence. Um, unfortunately, that's about all we can do with it since it's growing uh, primarily on the neighbor's uh, property. So we will try to control the buckthorn in that way. Hi, my name is Lauren and I am the head gardener at Bachman's here. And I wanted to discuss why I um, am so passionate about my work here with Bachman's. And I guess it gives me an opportunity to um, let people connect with nature. I think that's really important for everyone and to be able to create a space where people want to come and sit and enjoy um, what they have, that's important to me. And hopefully I get to connect with the homeowner and make them you know, feel that way too and want to sit out and enjoy their space. So that's my main goal here while I am working with Bachman's. So we are getting towards the end of the summer season now, sad to say, we are rolling into the end of July, August. There's still plenty of summer left, but um, it's a little bit cooler. Um, there are different tasks that uh, need to be done in the garden at this time of year. Uh, one of the things we try not to do at this time of year is we try to slow down on trimming and pruning. And the reason is because if you trim late, the shrubs um, will start to regrow. And then that new regrowth is very susceptible to cold damage and that opens up wounds and can create major problems. Uh, so 
Um, also, another thing that slows down, thank goodness, uh, are the weeds. As long as you've stayed on top of them, um, you shouldn't be weeding as much this time of year. So that's a good thing. Um, but, you know, gardens who really, uh, gardens that really haven't had much care over the summer are really going to uh, need some attention. So, um, you know, one of the things that we are focusing on as a garden maintenance team this time of year is um, garden renovations or full garden uh, maintenance overhauls, um, which uh, I, some clients, um, you know, it gets away from them. It's a lot of hard work. Um, they haven't had time over the summer. So that's when we come in and really make the gardens shine. Hi, my name is Anna and I'm with Bachman's Garden Maintenance Department. I'm here today to remind you of all of the different areas that our talented crews can help you with your property. Uh, so like you saw today, uh, we can do this kind of work at your own residence. Garden maintenance is a very popular service for customers who desire to have gorgeous, fresh gardens, but maybe don't have the time to do it themselves. Um, so that's where we come in. You meet with our designer, Ashley, figure out what your needs and budgets are, set up a visit frequency that works best for you, and we come out and take care of all of the work. Along with maintenance, we also provide a variety of planting services, whether it be planting seasonal containers with colorful annuals, or designing a perennial bed for years of beauty to enjoy. Um, in addition to our garden maintenance services, we're actually a part of a larger department. That includes Bachman's professional landscape design and builds, interior landscaping, and garden coaching. If you're interested in what you saw today or want to learn more, please don't hesitate to reach out and visit us at bachmanslandscaping.com. So if you have any questions, just visit us online at bachmans.com where you can find an abundance of care sheets on just about any topic related to gardening you can imagine.